Hi guys and good evening on this very special Monday. Um, I got a few things I'm going to go over and I got to get jump right into the 30 item swap um, from my person on, fa on the Facebook group, Junk Journaling for Everyone. If you're not a fan, you should get over there and look because just look at the group. I mean, it is fun. There's so many good people on there and then um, they do a lot of fun stuff. Okay, so right into it. I'm going to lower the camera and we're going to get started because I think I might have to do this in two videos. All right, here we go. So first up, I wanted to show you that this is called, I just call it Japanese braiding because it's easier. It's actually kumihimo. Kumihimo, I think, which means something braids. I don't remember, but anyhow. So then I this will be in a tassel at some point. So I make those with these wheels. Now these wheels aren't too expensive. I got this one. <clears throat> I want to say at a hobby store. In a kit. A small little kid's kit. And it was, I don't know, three or four dollars for the whole kit including the, the thread and everything. So anyhow, jump on YouTube. Tons of videos out there on that. So that was my I made it thing. Okay, so I'm just going to go. Um, I'm going to be honest with you. I couldn't wait to see what was in here. So I just opened this all up. And so this was supposed to be a 30 item swap. I would be well... I would say it's well over a hundred. So anyhow, I'm not going to count, but just, this is just a few of the things that were inside of this box. And, um, she made a few things and put them in there. These are really nice. <clears throat> and I know I need to get a scoring board, guys. I really do need a scoring board. These are just pretty, just beautiful. Um, here's some more. Here's some more. I think I have this paper. And then here is a envelope that she made and stamped. There's two of them. And they're just, one says radish and fruitful. And the other one has frogs and stones. And then it's just, it looks to me like a magazine paper. But anyhow, beautiful stuff. Beautiful stuff. It just goes to show you. Look at this individual score sheets. I had to go through this really quick on my lunch break, so I wanted to get back to it. Um, this is awesome. Seat, seat at the table. And then just a bunch of stamps and oodles and gadgets and just all kinds of neat stuff. Okay, and then these little guys, those are really cute and they're just little pins paper fasteners and then some stamps I hope you guys can see all of this and then some faux leather which is really nice a lot of nice little fabric snippets and then she too makes really neat paper clips so I'm going to put that there that I don't lose at a pinwheel I mean there's just amazing stuff some wooden embellishments and then I told her I was really into the steampunk stuff so she sent me some good stamps for steampunk journaling and I'm gonna go I will use these on the on the jelly pad and make make some good paper with that oh gosh sorry guys my nose I was sneezing earlier okay and then this so just a book page she made these double pockets. I just, I just, I mean, tickets. Aren't those cool? This looks, it's, it's an, an index card. So everything's pretty easy to, I don't know how she made that. That's very cool. And then uh, my name, the letter R on a license plate, which is really cool. And then another pocket. This. I mean, there's just 
like I said, a nice beautiful envelope, some feathers, tulip, birds and mice, mice and flowers, a kitty, a hedgehog, a puppy, and then this is some farm scenery with mountains and cabins and the picket fence. These are stamps. And this is paper she makes. This is all paper she makes. Isn't that neat? I just I just think it's beautiful. Look, create. I'm not this good yet, Faith. Someday I hope to be. This is just interesting. And I realize, like I said, I'm flipping through it pretty quick because there's just so much of it. And then this little pocket, real simple, just made with um, a little bird. Now I think this looks like the bird she um, embroidered and showed me. So really nice stuff. Really, really, really nice stuff. And then these are all just different buttons. And I really like that one. I don't know why, but I really like that one. And then a um, hidden paper clip, which is really cool. Some flower stickers. Note, notebook, note cards with envelopes. An index card. Make good use of today. And then she had that stamp. I, I surmise that's a stamp. It looks like a stamp. Okay, and then isn't this beautiful? So her and Linda, the other person that I swapped with, just I this amazed me. This things that they these ladies can do. This is real pretty. Really pretty. And this, this is like it's got the plastic inside of it so it makes a little little noise and then this beautiful paper this beautiful paper and some of this she had wrapped in just this beautiful 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 like this this was full of stuff that she had wrapped for me and I very carefully unwrapped it so that I could keep even the the tissue paper so <clears throat> thank you Ruth you taught me I, I just didn't know I mean I'm still new to this but how to put together this really nice package that was phenomenal okay so I'm gonna keep that paper and then I'm gonna keep this little bag even the little bag is really cute that would be nice for something and a little butterfly tag on it I don't know where y'all find such cute things okay we're coming out with some more stuff this was wrapped around one of the little books, I think. And then these tags. I don't know if she bought these like this or if she made this whole thing. It really looks to be homemade because some of them on the back are paper. I'm not sure, but it's, it's beautiful. And then the little tag with the wax seals. Some little critters, bears and sheep and piggies and wolves. And then some really pretty stamps. And I'll go through those at another time when I have more time. This is really nice. I don't know where she found this, but this is just really cool. <clears throat> more fabric. This is neat. More fabric squares, little samples. That goes on the little journal she made. Look at this envelope. I just thought this was so clever and cool. Really nice. And then a stack of fabric scraps. I really like that. I like all of it. And I really like this. So that was pretty nice. And then some, some charms. They have love in Chinese, strength in Chinese, happy, health, lucky, heaven. Okay, so... Got to keep moving, guys. I want to keep this at 15 minutes. And then um, I had talked to her about wanting to make a cowboy journal. And so she sent me some very, very 
country cowboy ranch kind of stuff. This was just so neat. So all of this was really nice. This was something else. And it had a variety of stuff, but look at that. Isn't that beautiful? So she's given me some good ideas. Really good ideas. Here's some um, strips of uh, lace or, or embellishment or um, binding. Whatever you want. To, anything, anything goes on this. And even this is on a decorative piece of paper. So then some more tags. Not tags. Yeah, tags. I don't even, I'm so new to this, I'm not even sure what name. Look at this. This is, and I'm, I'm going to bet this is paper she's made. And then the same thing over here. Really nice. I recognize that stamp. And then some paper clips and charms. Like I said, I didn't really get a chance to go through this today. Some cogs. Look at that. That is really cool. And then some keys and cogs. And these uh, policy folders. I remembered this. Policy folders. Isn't that cool? So I will follow her lead on how to make those. Like I said, I'm sure 99.9% .9 of this Anything that has the paper with it is stuff that she's made. And I'm just like, I can't wait to be that good. I really can't. Okay, so the next set. This is a corner for an envelope. And it basically slides on this way, but I was like, I have not seen one like that. Never. That was beautiful. And then just some little papers and this is really cool stickers some paper another western style tassel with has an L oh, I thought that was really cool and another envelope and some more ivy you gotta really be careful with that another envelope so neat and then I think if I'm not mistaken, there's, that is so cool. There's a little corner right there. So neat. I really got to, like I said, you just, when you get stuff like this, you go through it and through it. Look at these clocks and numbers and metal um, paper clip and I think this is a cluster. So it's very pretty. And then this with other stuff in it. Just so beautiful. And then some stamps. I love the little mason jars. And this. I love this. That is just so cool. See, this is the kind of stuff that I want to learn how to make. And I just got to follow, you know, look at it and just be scrutinized and learn. This is just beautiful. Okay, so then here are some little mason jars with washi tape. So cute. And some more charms. Lots of charms. And then some more stamps. Thank you, or wait, wait. Thanks, enjoy, peace, and love. And then this looks like um, let's party birthday stuff. Birthday stuff there. And then this one is life is a journey, not a destination. Just a lot of my boys. A lot of nice little is attitude is everything. A lot of nice little stamps in there. beautiful tassel. See, this is what I want to learn how to make. I have those. Yes, this is just perfect. Look at all of the fabric, different fabrics. See, I I think that I probably throw so much stuff away. This is the 
off of a shirt, button-up shirt. I'll have to keep that in mind when I go to throw my stuff away. You know, my closet doesn't fit anymore. Wooden stamps, like wooden embellishments, postage stamps. This is the little mini journal. And it's it's just got lots of little tucks, lots of little things. This inside here, there's stuff. It's filled with stuff. And I actually think, yeah, that's what... I was afraid to do that. See, all of these have stuff in them. Everything. And then the outside has stuff in it. And then the inside. This is just, look at this. A mini inside of a mini inside of a mini. See that? That is, see? I mean, you wouldn't think, but that's really simple and quick. It's beautiful, beautiful stuff. Beautiful stuff. So, I got to get busy. And then she had this wrapped around everything with, and she, I think she embroidered my initial on it. That was really cool. So that gave me some really cool ideas. And then look at this. Um, got a little smash, but it's a hidden paper clip. Beautiful. I'm going to put that up there for safekeeping. And some more really pretty paper. This I love. I love that. I'll put it there because it's and then another envelope. See, this is just so clever. I mean, just so clever. And I was talking to my friend Linda about um, shiny stuff. So I have an idea for some of these. And then some tags. I love the tags. Blank so I can decorate them. More beautiful flowers. And this is like a photograph like a um, picture holder and she she drew the mushroom herself and signed it Ruth Baker that is so awesome and then on the other side is it is a it looks to me like it's a cone flower and she's also signed that so I feel honored to even you know to get all of this stuff but uh, personal drawings fantastic this came with the little punch thing. Um, this guy. This guy right here. So i got to learn more about that. I've, there, a lot of this stuff I've never had. And then little cards. Little envelopes with cards in them. Which is so cool. And then another one of these tags that has the plastic in it. Makes lots of noise. And look at the little ladybug. And then I see how she's used that fabric. And I have a bunch of this, so yay for me. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to emulate here. Look at this. And I'm not, this is like really thick, almost, uh, almost like a plastic, but it's really nice. And then, look at this. Isn't that cool? See, and I didn't, I never think about stuff like this, so, but I will be, I will be, I will be, I will be, and we're almost to the end, almost. These little guys are so cute. They remind me of the Angry Birds, and then a little card holder or money holder, not sure, but some more of those little guys. And then a Christmas tree bulb maker. So you could do, you know, each color different. And there's a little piece of paper in there. I'm not sure what that is, but... Oh, it shows you how to make that. That is so cool. So cool. Anyhow, really good stuff. And then... Some flower embellishments or ephemera. I, I never know what I'm saying or if I should be calling it that or not. And then a little teddy bear punch. More tassels. These are just so cute. Very, very, very cute. That is just amazing. So she's given me a lot to work with and a lot of ideas. So 
The last thing was this purse. Do you believe this purse? Look at this. I mean, I was... I first saw it and I thought, I want that purse for me. So I don't know if I can cut it or not. I don't know. I'm, I'm going to hold on to it for a little bit and just look at it because it just it's just... It blows my mind. So that's it, guys. That is the entire thing. 20 minutes of unboxing. So I'm going to stop here and get started on some other stuff. But thank you. Um, thank you, Ruth. That was, that was above and beyond. And I really do appreciate it. Thank you so much. All right, guys. Have a great night. Keep subscribing. Keep crafting. Keep living. Keep having fun at it. Bye-bye, guys.